So we're starting today in Park Ridge, Illinois. Big load junk removal. Customer tried to do the job themselves, but they burned out really fast. They decided to call us with our 50 yard dumpster and eight man crew to expedite the clean out. They tried to do a do it yourself junk removal and they, uh, they burned out a little bit. So uh, we brought, she decided to go with us and we're gonna give it our best try. Uh, we might finish it in two loads. We'll see if it's a big, big amount of junk. Starting out with empty load. This is Park Ridge, Park Ridge, Illinois. Okay, got it. Okay. This is Park Ridge, Illinois. It's a, it was a flooded hoarder basement clean out. Okay, we're updating Park Ridge, Illinois. Flooded hoarder basement. Smashing up all the wood pieces flat. Everything weighs a lot more once it's wet, when it gets wet. So we're making fast work out of this. Okay. Good progress. Keep that. All the stuff in this room goes? Yeah. Okay. All right. And the washer dryer too? Yeah. Are they okay? They're already disconnected. Uh, I don't know. So. Okay, we're updating Park Ridge, Illinois. We're coming up on a, about 20, 25 yards. Packing it in like real tight, professional. You know, give the customer their money's worth. Another loading update for our customers who don't want to watch us. And we're really giving their money's worth. Pack everything very. Tight, get as much as we can. Break up all the bulky wood stuff. This is Park Ridge, Illinois. Quarter wet, wet basement cleanup. Another update from Park Ridge. Flooded quarter basement cleanup. Very heavy stuff, very heavy furniture and clothes and books. Load. Coming all the way from the side of the house. Yeah, look at the size of that thing. Man. We're gonna smash that one up. Yeah, they had a good sledgehammer one. You'll have to sweep it up. You can spill it out a lot if you want. Yeah, we got we got room to sweep that. Look at that thing come apart, man. Good, good technique. That's how we get more in the truck. Smash everything flat, down flat. There we go, we flatten that stuff and get more in the truck. Professional dumpster packing. And we got another room here. And this room. Okay. And then uh, you want this refrigerator out too? No, that one stays okay. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna keep this cabinet and the fridge. There's a, a lot of appliances in here. There's three of them, right? Yeah. Okay. We're in Park Ridge today, handling a hoarder house. This this basement got flooded pretty well. They tried to do it themselves, but they burned themselves out. They couldn't do it. Our secret is uh, the eight-man crew. And 
start smashing things up too. It gets a lot more in there. No pide lo de Mexico, güey. Demoing all the furniture for the customer. They never watch us, so I have to video it. Yeah, it's coming down and coming down. That's how we get more in the truck. Get those weak swings. <laughs> Wasn't even giving. So we just shut the halfway door. We're gonna top everything off best we can. This is Park Ridge, Illinois. Flooded before the basement. We're topping it off in Park Ridge today. Got a good chunk of the basement cleaned out. And we'll sweep up everything. And we're topping it off today in Park Ridge. Giving the customer their money's worth. Get as much as we can in the truck. And uh, they may not, they might not have a spec for the next load for a while. I think they need to sort through some of it. But we, we made a great difference in the basement. You can see how big the basement is now. Great improvement. Yeah. All right. Professional dumpster pack and just a wrap this load up. This is Park Ridge, Illinois. We maxed it out for the customer. We're gonna sweep up a little bit. And we'll call our load soon. We'll make sure to show the customer before I shut the door. We don't quit until it's totally full. We get as much as we can in there every time. And that's about all it can hold. Signing out from Park Ridge, Illinois. Well, there's a few things on the floor we got it. Oh, right there.